All right, Walker Nation, it's Dave Solo back with you from Walker Stalker Con, and I have the pleasure to be sitting next to Brighton Charbonneau, who played Lizzie on Walkie Dead. How are you? I'm great. How are you? Doing fantastic. What do you think of day one at Walker Stalker Con? Um, it's been pretty fun. You know, I'm hanging out with Merrick Murphy, Addie Miller, and you know, Madison Lentz, and that's been pretty cool. Awesome. I'm having fun hanging out with you. Oh. <laughs> Thank you. So Lizzie was such a, a complex character. Yeah. What was it like playing her? I mean, she was really interesting, and I had so much fun, you know. I went through, like, a bunch of stages of being, you know, the sweet little girl to the, you know, the mean hardcore killer to the completely insane, you know, little girl. What is it, you know, I'm sure people must, mis, you know, misunderstand and, and, and maybe, you know, have some misconceptions. Do you, what do you run into on the street when people approach you? I'm sure dad's around, and no one's going to mess with dad, I know that. But I was like, you're the girl from The Walking Dead, right? And I'm like, yeah, yeah, I am, yeah. <laughs> Do they ever say anything like, oh, why did you kill Mika, anything crazy? Yeah, like sometimes it's like um, something like, I'm really mad at you. And I'm just like, okay, um, I'm sorry about that. <laughs> I don't know, like I don't know, I'm, um, I'm a nice person. I, right. I can't really, you know, do anything a about Fantastic it. actress, too. You did such a great job. <laughs> So we, we obviously know about Lizzie and, and what happened with Lizzie. Yeah. But how about you? What do you uh, you know? What are you into? Are you into uh, to uh, on TV or what do um, you like to do with your friends? I I just like I like acting. It's really fun to me. And you know I I have an older sister and a little brother. And I'm I you know I like hanging out with my family. And I like just watching movies. And I I, I like acting mostly. And I like hanging out with my friends. Mm. Awesome. What's um? Are you a big fan of horror movies? Um, if I can tolerate them, like I can't, like if I see, like I, sometimes I can't sleep at night if I see too many scary ones, yeah. but yeah, I, I like, I like, well, yeah, I like a little bit of everything. It's awesome. Fun. So obviously, you know, you're a big star, you're an actress, you're following your dreams <laughs> and you know, you're definitely a role model for young girls. So uh, what advice would you give, you know, young girls that, that want to go after their dream? Um, you know, it's never too late to get started in something like I always feel like I'm, you know, I've, these other people have been doing it for years and stuff, but it's never too late to get started on something. If you just, you give it your hundred percent, then you can do it. That's fantastic. Mm -hmm. Last question. It's a zombie related question. The zombie apocalypse hits tomorrow. What's the first thing you're going to do? I'm going to find like a shelter. Like um, okay. One of my recent ideas that I've been going with for a while now yeah. is a human-sized gerbil. Like you know those gerbil balls that you like. Yeah, the, the ones you, you roll down the hill. Those ones for you do for fun and stuff. Well, I would get like some big spikes from Home Depot or something, and I'd put it and I'd glue it to the outside of the shell, so you know it wouldn't pop because it wouldn't be touching the ground. The spikes would be, and also I could roll over zombies. That's a great plan. Do you have a hamster in real life? No. <laughs> No, I, I have a I have a dog. Okay, you gonna put the dog in the hamster ball with you? Yeah, yeah, but I don't know how he'd use the restroom, so I don't. Know. <laughs> always thinking, always <laughs> thinking. Awesome. Thank you so much for joining us. We really appreciate yeah, it. Yeah, thank you guys.